Well, welcome back. You know, the ninth annual Call the Freedom Community Breakfast fundraiser is taking place October 9th. And joining us today to tell us how you can get involved, Rachel Schwartz and Becky Rasmussen with Call to Freedom. Thanks for coming in this morning. Good morning. Are you hey, good, to, good to see you. Good. Good to see you. Good to see you. Let's, first of all, let's just talk about if people don't know about what Call to Freedom is. Explain that to us, Becky. Yeah, absolutely. Call to Freedom is a nonprofit organization yeah. that provides supportive services to those that have been impacted by human trafficking sextortion or commercial sexual exploitation. And so um, when we started in 2016, I never thought I would see so many people walk through our doors that are victimized. We've served over 1,400 individuals that have been impacted in any of those areas and we continue to provide services. We do prevention, um, we do intervention, um, anything within that realm, Call to Freedom is, is playing a part. Let's talk about the event, October 9th, just to, uh, what it's all about and how people can get involved. Yeah, we're so excited to have our ninth annual community breakfast. Uh, so it's called a Freedom's uh, single annual fundraising event where uh, we really need a lot of resources to fund the, the, as Becky said, the rapid rate, unfortunately, at which we're seeing clients walk through our doors. But so much more than that, it's really just an uplifting community event. The name really says it all, where it's just palpable, the passion mm -hmm. that the community has for this issue and just to indicate their support for survivors. It's my favorite event of the year uh, where you get to hear directly from survivors, their stories where um, you're gonna hear from one survivor this year whose journey is, she has more courage and resilience than most of us could ever mm -hmm. imagine. It's just incredible to be a part of each year. Where's it at? Can people buy tickets or just explain, give a, tell us about that? Absolutely, free event to the okay. community. Folks can register at our website, calltofreedom.org. The event is going to be right here in Sioux Falls at the Sioux Falls Convention Center. Uh, so we're, we're just thrilled to, we wanna reach as many folks as we can uh, just through this event, especially if you're new to this space. You know, if human trafficking's mm -hmm. not an issue that you're familiar with and you want to learn more about how to get involved and how to impact this issue, mm -hmm. uh, we really encourage everybody to come and experience uh, that feeling of community mm -hmm. behind this issue. Have you seen, I mean, the fruits of your labor, I mean, obviously it's a horrific thing that, that yeah. goes on. People don't see it all the time, but it's happening. Uh, uh, what, what's being done to, to, to stop it or to help stop yeah, it? Yeah, I, I think there's a good collaboration yeah. within our community. I think awareness is key. Yeah. You know, if you're not talking about an issue, you're probably not getting the responses that you're looking for. And I think that's changed. You know, you see the P. Diddy cases going yeah. on nationally. Mm -hmm. um, and honestly, that happens locally. It just doesn't have the, the big names or the big faces behind it. And so it's really that collaboration piece between law enforcement, Call to Freedom that provides services, and then even our first responders within our community who are coming in contact with victims of human trafficking all the time. So education is a really big part. And at the breakfast, that's one of the things you will hear from those with lived experience and their journey. And I think people will walk away with their eyes opened. Um, it is a fundraiser, so I don't like to have surprises. There will be an ask at the event. However, if you're looking to get involved, you've been drawn to this, this is a wonderful event to come to just to learn more as well. Mm -hmm. And you can go to calltofreedom.org. Um, we do have to register before the event, um, and that'll probably close by Monday. Okay. So make sure to, so to get soon. on the site and, and mm -hmm. get that done. But I want to give you a gift, oh, if that's thank all right. You. Yeah, yes. absolutely. So this morning, we have a freedom candle, okay. which our partners at Freedom Studios actually hire survivors. Okay. And these are made by survivors of human trafficking. Everybody who's a table host at the breakfast this year will get a candle and it's specially made and the scent is specially designed by survivors awesome. for them. My wife's burning candles all yeah, the time. Yeah, this is, the well then tell your wife, <laughs> so we brought her a gift. I brought her a gift too. Well, <laughs> hey, well thank you for coming in and uh, you have a great event coming up on October 9th. Go, as you said, go there quickly and, and register by Monday. Yeah. So thank you so. for giving us an opportunity. Yes, we appreciate it. In. All right, stay with us, we'll be right back.